My name is Gilletta Jarvis, and I'm running for New Hampshire governor. Like you, I'm worried about the potential for a new tax in our state, what it would mean for our businesses, our tourism, and our citizens. Like you, I worry about our energy costs and how large next year's budget proposal will be. I worry about the rising cost of education and New Hampshire's opioid addiction rates. I'm tired of waiting for some mysterious politician who will appear out of the woodwork and care about those of us who are not counted amongst the wealthy. I'm running for governor because I genuinely care about this state and the people that I share it with. I will be fighting for you to keep as much of your hard-earned money in your pocket as possible. That means working to fix our energy and healthcare regulations that have driven up your costs. It means working to promote new and innovative technologies in our state through fixing small business regulations and occupational licensing. It means supporting our low-income residents to find work by reforming our welfare programs so that these able-bodied people are not forced to become dependent on the state. I'm proposing that we work together to fix the problems in New Hampshire. The hemp industry can create hemp planks and insulation which are resistant to mold, fire, mildew, and wood-boring insects, all of which we face here in New Hampshire. And we are currently allowed to own these products, but we're not allowed to create them or grow it here. Let's revolutionize our green science industry in New Hampshire and be leaders in the industry in America. Let's also remove those occupational licenses that do not support public safety, but support the bigger businesses keeping the smaller entrepreneurs out. We already removed the requirement for hair braiding, but there are more that do not pose a public threat if they're unlicensed by the state. Let them license if they want to, so that you can use your power of choice to determine who you want to do business with. There should not be a reason to have multiple licenses to start up a business. It's just red tape. It costs time and money on the part of the small business and on the state, and it's money that we don't need to be spending. Let's fix education in this state. According to a study published in April of this year, there are only four states that can boast that their high school graduates are qualified to attend in-state colleges if they are not honor students and New Hampshire is not one of them. Yet our education prices are getting so high that many towns are reporting that people are leaving due to the increase in costs or considering taking the state back to court. I'm proposing that we form an education commission to work on this problem, to fund students' education choices by determining what they need to actually qualify to attend college and what the cost of that education is. I'm also proposing a cap to local school districts on what they can ask for outside of this amount from the families in their district that the voters can then vote yes or no on and they, if they want to, they can still donate more than that. But they cannot request more via taxes. Let's also legalize cannabis as it has been proven to bring down addiction rates in those areas that have legalized it. We need to stop basing our regulations on outdated fears put into place years ago by racist government officials. Legalization will bring down violence as well from the need for people to seek out unsavory drug dealers who may push solutions that may get people addicted to substances that could lead to their demise. Let's use the funds set aside for incarceration of cannabis users towards treatment and mental health facilities to promote prevention of addiction and to help those who need it the most but are having a hard time finding it. Let's hold our public officials accountable and make our government regulations easy to find and access, including business licenses needed, better search functions, and how to file a complaint. It's 2018 and time to bring our website up to standards. Let's make our New Hampshire state government, the most user-friendly government there is. Let's use this year to think differently and vote differently. Vote Gilletta Jarvis for New Hampshire governor.